What is a rock? Well, a rock is a heterogeneous substance, a solidified mixture of various minerals. There are three major classifications, which can form by solidification, sedimentation, or metamorphism. However, all types are interdependent in something called the rock cycle. Imagine a volcano. Magma travels and cools into the cavities of the mass, creating intrusive igneous rock. Lava that solidifies outside of the volcano is known as extrusive igneous rock. When rock is eroded by the elements, loose particles called sediments break off. These sediments collect and compact in layers, creating sedimentary rock. If a rock is subjected to immense pressure and heat, its composition changes, forming a new rock altogether. These are called metamorphic rocks. All of these rocks, which contain minerals, can be found in Quebec. For example, the micas are minerals that can be found in igneous, metamorphic, and sedimentary rock. Granite, composed of minerals like feldspar and quartz, is an igneous rock. Apatite is found in igneous and metamorphic rocks. Mineral deposits are high concentrations of minerals found in a specific place. One such deposit is a vein. Veins, which are irregular fissures, are filled with mineral solutions. Solutions of brine, which is impure water, transport the necessary elements to make the minerals. Once the fissure is filled, the cooling of the surrounding rock supersaturates the solution, creating a solid called a precipitate. This occurs because as the solution cools, less can be dissolved, which means there will be some material left at the bottom. The heating and evaporating of the water also leaves a precipitate. An ore is a rock containing one or more useful and profitable metals. Think of an ore as a box of colored candies, where each color represents a different mineral. A box of candy contains many different colors, but perhaps only the red ones can be sold to make money. There are various ores for every profitable metal, but only an ore with a high percentage of the metal is economical. In other words, a box of candy with more red ones can make more money faster. Many useful minerals are mined in Quebec, including iron, copper, nickel, platinum, zinc, silver, diamond, titanium, granite, uranium, and rare earth metals. Quebec is responsible for about 40% of Canada's iron production. Several iron ores are found in Quebec, namely specular, hematite, magnetite, goatite, and limonite. Once the ore is mined, the iron must be extracted. Various chemical reactions conducted in a blast furnace are used to isolate the iron. The general chemical equation is as follows. Iron oxide reacting with carbon forms iron and carbon dioxide. In some cases, carbon monoxide is used in place of carbon. However, before money can be made, miners must discover a mineral deposit. One way is through core sampling. Special drills are used to extract core samples of the bedrock, which are then examined and tested for profitable minerals. One method of determining the identity of a mineral is by using the flame test. Minerals that contain specific ions will transform the color of the flame. This is best explained by photons. For example, take a sodium ion, Na positive. When put over a flame, its electrons absorb energy and enter an unstable excited state. The electrons will then jump shells and emit energy in the form of light to stabilize. The color it emits depends on the amount of energy it releases. The amount of energy that sodium releases corresponds to the color yellow on the electromagnetic spectrum, which is why you see a pretty yellow flame.